Hey, you, you mind, Orton? Triple H, come out here and get it too. Do this work. How the hell do you pick him up? There we go, there we go, circle. Okay. Hit him in the cage. There we go, hit him. About to stone close to this one. Got him. <laughs> Got him, coach. Give me in the damn game. watch wrestling back in the day or you even had a PS2 you probably had this game this game is the greatest game at this time I'm playing on the emulator right now so uh, the quality might get messed up here and there but the quality is amazing with uh, being on a computer let's see what are we gonna do let's do a Royal Rumble how about that let's, <laughs> let's do a damn Royal Rumble and I'm gonna start number one um who do I wanna be I, wanna be? I have somebody in mind but I don't know I'm just going down this right now. See, I, I don't watch wrestling anymore, so I don't know anything about any current wrestlers. Like, I hear things here and there, but I don't really know anything about current guys. Let's try Stone Cold Steve Austin. I'm gonna come in there too. Like Alright, and um. I'm not gonna look at the list. I just hope it's not something crazy. Any options? Okay, whatever. We'll just, uh. Yes, but... no. No. Okay, random doesn't work. All right. Anyway, let's get into it, guys. Randy Orton, look at that young, handsome man, Randy Orton. See, the only reason I really know about Randy Orton nowadays is because of uh, the RKO bombs. There's a guy, legend, Goldberg, Bill Goldberg, man. WCW legend who came to the movie. Yeah, I remember that. I stopped watching wrestling in 2007, I'm say. No? Not even 2007, like 2005, but I kept, I tried to keep up with it about 2007. It, wrestling, it just went downhill in terms of like PG. Probably, if it wasn't PG today, like, if I had this storyline today, I think I'd watch it. Because I have the WWE Network, and I'm currently watching the old school stuff. You know, I get free time, man. I get bored. But, um, because on you know, Netflix is not worth our cameras and that material. But here's the Texas Rattlesnake. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Man. This guy right here, he's my, he's number one all the time in my opinion. I'd probably make a top three list in another video, but like, top ten list, but like, I'd probably make a top ten list. But Stone Cold Steve Austin just had the energy and the talk and just a, just a bad guy. You know? He was a good guy. He just didn't take any shit, put it like that. Stone Cold Steve Austin didn't take any shit whatsoever. Let me just start this because I don't want to get copyright. Alright, I hope that doesn't get copyright. But anyway, let's get into this. I really don't know anything. Any controls whatsoever. I played a few matches. And it is currently 2 a.m. right now. And the timer's already starting? The fuck? I just gotta run him for a minute. <laughs> See, shit like that, man. We get, we get specials already? Okay, sweet. Okay. Alright. So we play it safe right now. Damn, people keep coming in though. <laughs> God damn it, feels good. Oh my goodness. Chris Jericho, YTJ. You get one too, bitch. <laughs> that emotion right there. That's the... In my opinion, that's one of the best like specials next to um next to the choke slam and the um, the spear. Choke slam, the spear, the choke slam, the spear, uh, sweet chin music, anything with kicks is pretty amazing. And the swanton bomb, in my opinion. And the DDP is pretty damn good too, but that's my top five though. I don't know any controls, so I keep kicking. Oh, that's grappling. That's circle. Yeah, in this uh, emulator, I got all my controls set on my uh, DualShock controller, PlayStation. 
You motherfucker! God damn, bro. This shit's hard. I don't remember it, like, eliminating that fast. I don't definitely remember this timer being like this. Like, Rhino just came on the screen in 10 seconds to start again. And I went in my settings and tried to fix that, but okay, well, whatever. Uh, guys, let me know also if the settings are bad. Watch this. I'm gonna wait to the next wrestler. I'm gonna Right, the next rush I've ever seen that and we'll probably pick out the five. Not the six they're gonna be in. You guys remember Hurricane? I think that was a he was a trip. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and go with uh with Jericho. I mean not Jericho, Chris Benoit. RIP man. Chris Benoit and this entire family. In my opinion that wasn't his fault. That wasn't Chris that wasn't uh Chris Benoit's fault. He's doing this mother shit with steroids and all that. Oh, got him. Got him a crossbar. I just saw it pop him out of my screen. That's just off instinct right there alone when I was a kid. But um, going back to Jer uh, the, the Chris Benoit situation, I don't think that was his fault originally. Motherfucker, dude. Alright. But yeah, Chris Benoit and the whole, you know, like, the whole double murder, suicide. That shit was crazy, bro. That is you know, like, that and Eddie Guerrero's death were crazy, but if I was a little older, I probably responded more to the Chris Benoit thing. I was just young. I didn't know really what was going on too much. But that shit was crazy, though. Like, there was some steroids and other shit going on in his life that the wrestling, like, the WWE do now, you know? But that's just assumptions. I can't say anything. Um... I mean, my opinion doesn't really matter. I'm just a kid doing YouTube videos, just giving your opinion, you know, but, yeah, I was thinking it was foul play you know, and other things. Let me go ahead and choose some of this. I'm running. Gold Dust. You guys remember Gold Dust? Motherfucker, well, weird, man. If you guys are watching this, you're probably wondering why the hell I'm playing this game. I think, in my opinion, like, it's one of the, it's the best wrestling game ever. I swear to God. Yeah, that's that's why I started playing again. Like I was going to the PS2, and then I was like, oh, <laughs> Walls and Jericho, all these submission moves mean something like Stone Cold Steve Austin. But um, I just got bored of playing shooters and, uh, and playing what else was I playing? Uh, RTSs. Like I was playing, you know, the, not League of Legends, but like Rise of Nations and shit like that. I'm tired of playing that stuff. I'm gonna play some shooting games, some game up games. This is definitely one. I might even make a series out of this shit, just here and there. In my free time. That's a huge one. Out of all these people in here, I only think like two of these guys wrestle, so like, I don't know anything. Like, I don't know if Gold does it does. I know Chris Jericho still does stuff, for sure. He does like a podcast for sure, I know that. Batista, haven't seen that name in forever, yeah, that'd be with the fucking beast coming out. Him and, um, Brock Lesnar are fucking beast, man. Like, this huge ass dude. That's getting, I'm getting chills now. Alright. Those guys are just huge, man. I remember being a little kid, just, like, the first time seeing those guys, it's just amazing. And John Cena, John Cena back when he was a thug. You don't know anything about... I'm like, if you know old wrestling, you don't know that new John Cena shit, like, he's pulling, like, the old John Cena was, a, like, a fucking, um, again, oh, get, get in the damn ring. Yeah, John Cena was a thug back then, he was rapping and shit, I'm saying with the picture, you caught him. So I have, oh, I have a special, I to get down. I don't know how to get down without jumping, um. Oh, Ooh, you almost caught me, bitch. Got him. Took me the game, coach. And I fucked up my head doing that. I know. I know I'm sexy. I've got the looks. The drive the girl wild. Oh. Bam, nigga. <laughs> oh, he caught his ass. Uh, RVD. RVD is one of my favorites, man. One of my favorites, and Shawn Michaels, not yeah, Shawn Michaels, uh, Chris Jericho ain't doing shit with these specials, man. This shit ain't gonna help me win. God damn, Kevin Nash. That motherfucker's old, man. He was old in this game. But RVD is like, you thought you could sneak up on me, John Cena? Damn it, come on. 
Oh, uh, Ravens. Man, all these classic names, yo. Like, does these motherfuckers wrestle? I'm about to get eliminated. Bitch. God damn. But does, do these guys even wrestle anymore? I know Rob Van Dam is old. I, I checked up his Twitter not so long ago. Uh, Frank Mysterio, I'm, I know he killed somebody recently. That was that was a big YouTube video. You know, I stay on YouTube and shit. That was a big video. Um, see, one thing I hate about this game too is every Frank Mysterio did the 649. It went to the, uh, the screen, wherever he was at. It went to the camera chains there, so he really screwed up. Uh, see, go ahead, go Booker T, man. Booker T is really... Booker T is so underrated, though. Under-fucking-rated. Let's go! I really gotta go ahead and edit this shit, too, so I can get it, uh, zoom in on these guys. And look at all these fucking legends in, in the ring at one time. All of them. I don't know what that is right now. I can, I mean, I can attack Brock Lesnar, but that ain't gonna be too much. I can out I can out be uh, Brock Lesnar by speed alone, but once he gets up and I'm on the ropes, it's over. Shit. See that fucking that fucking camera, dude. Now, you can't even attack Ray Mysterio. Like he can, I can eliminate him right there, but he's on top of that shit. Oh shit, you remember. <laughs> you remember. Oh, this is racist. See, they got him like King Booker or some shit now, right? I don't even know if he's still wrestling. Last time I checked, it King Booker. Which is. Uh... Speaking of wrestling, man, like. I don't know. Shit's just weird now. Shit is so weird. Because you know. If you were growing up and you watched wrestling, you had people of all ages watching shit, like your parents, maybe your dad or something like that, if you're using your life, your mom, or whoever. Like, wrestling used to be cool back in the day. Now it's just one franchise, and I have competition. That's one thing I learned. WWE nowadays it does have competition, so they can literally do the market any way they want with the, with the, uh, the PG era. You know, um, competition makes great, great quality, you know? That's one thing that when it comes down to anything in life, any any product that you that you invest money to, it comes down to. It. And that's just simple. Ooh. Triple X. Alright. So Johnson is gone. He's pulling the rock right now. The one guy left. Um, I don't know who it is. And Triple H's about to give me a pedigree. Yep. Yeah. Alright. I can't really do anything about this person right now. I don't know how to do it. Kurt Angle, dude, that guy's underrated too. Kurt fucking Angle, like back when them, back when them WWE was in the golden ages of the uh, the early 2000s. Kurt Angle, one of those guys, and he's got eliminated, so it wasn't really too much help. So it's just us four left. Um, yeah, I knew the Rock would do that. I ran him last second. Okay, I did not expect him in the studio, but you want to go? If the fucking Rey Mysterio eliminates me, and the Rock is good right now. The Rock and Triple H both are good, and the Rock's about to set me up for failure. What the fuck? Get out of here, dude. And Rey Mysterio got eliminated. See, because that, that damn specials in this game. Look, Triple H is literally standing there looking at the motherfucker face to face, yo. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> this fucking game. Help me out, Triple H, you bitch. Help me out. Thank you, jeez. Right, I think I can win Booker T. If I play it safe here, I can win Booker T. I'm just waiting for my time to attack. Ha <laughs> ha, I got him with it. Got him with it, time to attack. Oh, shit. Uh, I don't know how to grip. I don't know how to grip. Oh, circle. Oh, Booker T is almost that special too. Oh, you motherfucker! <laughs> ah, I need to know how to reverse. God damn it! He's about to get another one too. I'm, I'm screwed. Get up! Move, 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 move! You motherfucker! That's the game. That's the game right there. That's the game. <sighs> All right, well, guys, I'm gonna make another video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. You know, um, I hope my mic wasn't too loud for this. Um, I really hope you guys know of this game. It's one of the best wrestling games ever of all time. That Royal Rumble right there was pretty fun.
and seeing guys come in and out, guys that I've seen forever. But um, yeah, if you guys are new, check out the channel. I make other videos and different games all the time. And if you guys enjoyed this video, you guys leave a comment. That always works, man. I love reading comments. Till then, guys. See you later.